Yeah, I'm going to be making some um, liposomal L-glutathione, and I'm using uh, capsules versus um, powder in raw form. What I have to do is take it outside of the capsules, and I use eight capsules. It's about one level tablespoon, and I use the scissors to uh, cut the end of the capsules and pour them in there, and make sure I got not quite a level tablespoon, but you know I tap it down. And we use the lecithin granules, non-GMO. I put three level tablespoons in a container of distilled water, up to uh, eight ounces of distilled water. Three level tablespoons of non-GMO lecithin in a um, tablespoons of non-GMO lecithin in a distilled water, eight ounces. Put it in a blender, I put it on low speed for a couple minutes. Now this is all ready to go inside the uh, ultrasonic cleaner. This is a um, commercial duty ultrasonic cleaner, fairly good one. Maybe not a heavy duty commercial one, but a commercial one anyway, none, nonetheless. But um, what we're gonna do is we're gonna pour this lecithin solution into the ultrasonic cleaner. Now this has a heater, we're not going to use the heater function, but I'm going to use the timer up to 30 minutes. I'm going to use it on 30 minutes without the timer. Now the next thing I'm going to do is I have four ounces of water, distilled water, I'm going to put the glutathione in it and mix it up and make sure it is totally thoroughly mixed before it goes in with the lecithin. Okay, so I see you use eight capsules of uh, L-glutathione. You can see two, um, two, four, six, eight. And I, like I said, I cut them open with the um, scissors. It's almost a level tablespoon. Now it's thoroughly mixed up in here. So the solution is mixed up. And just to make sure. And the next step is to uh, turn on the um, cleaner. And you know, I'm gonna we're gonna stir it every five minutes with a plastic spoon, but basically that's it. And after this is done. It goes in the refrigerator. I'm going to put it in this container and um, take about, um, I'd say it will be a 12 ounce solution. I'll take um, about two ounces of it a day, which will be a little more than 500 um, grams, milligrams of L glutathione per day. It'll be a little bit more than that. So I think that'll work, but you have to. Uh, the thing is, you know, I read there's other more complicated ways of making this, but I'm going to make it this way. But I do know that you have to use a stronger um, ultrasonic cleaner and set it on longer than you do for the vitamin C. I heard you can make it in the same procedure. There's other compli more complicated ways to do it, but I'm going to keep it simple and just do it this way. But And the best price I found, I don't sell this stuff or nothing, was from Swanson. L-glutathione. There might be better deals out there, but this is probably the simplest thing to do. And if, you, like I said, if you're wondering how to open up the capsules, you can pull them apart, but it's a lot easier to cut the ends with the scissors and uh, get it on there. The next time I'm going to make it, though, I think I'm going to order um, sunflower lecithin versus uh, non-GMO soy lecithin. I'm going to get sunflower lecithin. But for now, this is what I'm going to be doing. I think it's simple. It, it is in a, one of the methods um, that I've researched is still legit. There's better ways of doing it, but this is a hell of a lot less complex. So that is an advantage in itself.